Hey guys, Dragon here from MuseShop.net and today we are talking about the animated counters widget for Muse. Here we have the demo we made for the widget and it's simply a great way to present your stats in a modern way. So let's head over to Muse and see how you can create your own counters. I have an example over here and let's learn how to create animated counters from scratch and apply them to any numbers inside Muse. So click on library and here we have the widget, drag it onto your canvas and what it does, it targets the graphic style of the number. So we click on the number and click on graphic styles. My already has a graphic style called numbers one, but we can repeat the process, create a new graphic style name and let's say my numbers. Then you click on the widget, click on the widget settings and enter the same graphic style name over here. Make sure you follow the exact capitalization and use only letters and numbers and dashes. So my numbers. You can also set the animation duration and the animation delay. So now we're gonna take this off of our page and let's preview. As you can see, we've turned this text into an animated counter. Okay, let's delete this and let me show you how you can use our templates. So open your library and here we have the templates. Now the cool new thing with Muse CC 2017 is that you have this over here and if you click on this while you drag your widget onto the canvas, it will automatically create the breakpoints. So if you're using our default Muse template or if you have a full HD breakpoint as your starting point you can simply click over here while dragging not over here and do as I do. Let's take the first example and click on it and if your page is 1920 pixels wide go to this edge and release and check out what happens. As you can see the the counters are restyled for this breakpoint and for this and for this one as well as you can see and for the mobile that's awesome and now what we do we go back and we pull our main widget and the process is the same click on the numbers our templates should have graphic styles already so as you see it's called counter so do the same over here, type in counter in the widget and let's preview this in browser. I made a typo over here, let's preview again. And here we have it, that's it.